Hello, Gina here, and I'm here with the eighth layout in my Page Kits with Scraps uh, series. And this is my Page Kit. And these are photos of when my husband and daughter, my niece, um, and her baby went to Comic-Con. And there she is. Isn't she cute? Just taking a nap. All right, so I am just taking off that extra piece from these uh, papers, which came in a 12 by 12 paper pad. So I'm thinking I want to layer those together, but then I end up layering that, yeah, that pretty turquoise, a solidy uh, color. Um, on black and I'm going to do a two pager um, yeah so I don't know yeah, I think I do get to both But here I am trying to figure out what I want to do, how I want to lay everything out. All right, I'm looking at that other one too. So yeah, it is a two pager. So my husband, that's my husband, my daughter, um, this was the first year she had gone to Comic-Con and she's usually scared because we usually go for the walking dead and she's just you know was totally not into that before and she still isn't but she was okay to go to the uh to go to comic-con like i said um we went with my niece and then her new baby well not new baby she's two and uh yeah kylie is in love with her and uh olivia with my daughter so yeah she totally wanted to go and she was pushing her around and stuff like that so they both had a blast just being together so for this layout i'm just cutting it down uh quarter of an inch on two sides i think yeah So I have my photos that I want to use. I was trying to use scraps to mat, but yeah, the pieces I have are just too small for the white cardstock. So I decided to mat the photos first on black instead of white. And Kylie is wearing one of the shirts, not one of the shirts, the shirt she got at Comic-Con. It's um, You Have Failed the City from Arrow. I don't know if you guys are familiar. So she got that one, that shirt. And then if to there to the left, I don't know how well you could see it. They brought us back a cookie and it's of the guy from Arrow. And my husband got a t-shirt, Mullet of Lies from Walking Dead. One of the guys has a mullet obviously so that's what these photos are here so i really like that picture paper i think it was in an eight and a half by eleven cards not card uh paper stack uh loose papers from that I got at Michael's. So there I cut that piece, the multicolored. I cut it and put a piece on top and a piece on the bottom. I decide to add this pretty heart, gray heart paper. And I think about matting it and I'm like, nah, I already inked the edges so I should be good like that. So I'm going to make another banner cut on the other side of that piece. It's going to be on both sides. So I don't know when I'm going to do that. So that's the place where I keep all my strips. 
um, like from sticker sheets and you know just anything strips and even some from papers like the branding strips I don't know if you heard that, but that's my dog. That wasn't me. He's, she's snoring in the background. All right, so I have that piece I'm putting back there on the bottom. And then I'm going to layer those up. And these pictures were taken in April of 2018. So not caught up at all, but that's okay. So there's my black cardstock to go behind, which I think that grounds it and makes it prettier. There's a piece I'm using. It was a cut apart, I think. Um, not a cut apart. I don't know where I got it from. I think it's just like loose, um, like Project Life type pieces. So I just got that from there and that's where my journaling is going to go. I like that it says don't quit your daydream I don't know what it has to do with comic-con but I thought it was cute and I like this the shape and everything else so just trimming that piece down and it's gonna go right over there and it says beautiful and a circle pointy finger piece. There's a little piece of a half of a frame I'm going to add there and then that piece says remember and it kind of looks paper clippy but I'm just going to use it as a flat sticker. So I try several things and this is probably the layout that's number seven, number eight, I'll, or no, number eight, number nine, I'll do next because I don't think I got both of them on this one video. So you'll see the other part to this shortly. So I've put, so sorry. <coughs> So I got a tickle. I put several little pieces there to the left. One is a frame and then a, ta uh, a little flag kind of piece and a label. Sorry, I still have that tickle. I don't know what happened. And I just have that pointing up to... <coughs> so sorry to that sticker that says don't quit your daydream and I don't think I use much more on this layout just that little piece I'm going to tuck behind there I'm going to add some enamel dots I know I'm going to put the date, April 7th, with some black ink. <clears throat> and I am using those Nouveau Tim Holtz, I think it's Tim Holtz. 
the nouveau drops and a little bit of those um, that other kind of enamel perfect pearl stuff I'm gonna ink put a little bit of ink not ink spray I guess same thing just a few little splatters around and that will do it for this layout so I thank you so much for watching and I will see you at the next video Bye.